I'm Alex Barth. I'm here to talk to you about a great new product. It's called Incognito. It is a product that produces both great flavor in beer as well as reduces process loss in the brew house. Incognito is a highly concentrated flavor hop product that's pourable at room temperature. It contains no vegetative material. It is easy to use, easy to ship and store, and helps you achieve great efficiency. You get consistently great tasting, flavorful beer. I've challenged my team to look at products that produce great flavor in beer, but reduce the process loss. Maximizing flavor, minimizing loss. IPA and variants of IPA, double IPA, session IPA, hazy IPAs, that is like the biggest beer style right now. And Incognito is a product that helps you get big hop flavor that works well in those styles of beer. One of the biggest challenges of making a, a super hoppy beer, you know, is, is loss. You lose a lot with uh, pellets or whole hops for that matter, you know, because you have an absorption rate of those hops and so it sucks in some of that, you know, precious wort over the course of a year. That's real, that's real money adding up. When you add a lot of hops to your system, you're losing wort as a result and in the end you're losing overall beer production. You add one kilogram of hot pellets to your, to your brew kettle, you're losing about 10 liters of wort. So if you translate that over the course of a year's worth of brewing, that winds up turning into quite a bit of beer and quite a number of barrels that you would otherwise be able to sell through your retail. All the brewers nowadays are trying to showcase hop aroma and flavor. So we're trying to really get as much fresh hop aromatic into beer as possible. And as brewers, we're trying to be efficient because at the end of the day, more work to the fermenter equals more finished beer. Losses are big, big, big for us. So, you know, we want to produce our beer very efficiently, very cost effectively. So using a product like Incognito really allows us to recapture a lot more of the beer out of it. Not only does it deliver a great beer, but it also, you know, delivers an economically viable product for us. From a usability standpoint, Incognito is a great product for the brewer to use because it's flowable at ambient temperatures. So there's no need to, to preheat this product before you use it. So you just pour it into the Whirlpool and, and off you go. The flowability is directly relatable to the solubility. So the idea was we wanted something that was soluble as well, that would go into solution readily. So the flowability is for ease of use and it's also for solubility since most of it's going to be going into your wort stream, into your fermenter, it's a lot easier to clean up because there's just less to clean up. If you can lower your BOD and your COD, your, your city municipalities are gonna love that. That's less biological oxygen demand, less chemical oxygen demand. Since it's easier to clean up, that's less chemicals that you have to use, so that's gonna lower your COD. And because you have less solids going down the drain, your BOD is gonna go down. You're saving money and saving more beer. Incognito is a varietal specific product. The varieties that are available are Citra, Mosaic, and Equinot. When we talk about varietal specificity, Citra Incognito is only made from Citra hops, and likewise, Mosaic and Equinot Incognitos are made from Mosaic hops and Equinot hops. And so, it gives you the same varietal character as the hops that they're made from. Yeah, it's very true to type. That's, that's the beauty of Incognito. Not only is it variety specific, but our sensory analysis in-house and with other brewers that are using our product have seen a very true to type, consistent flavor profile. It's really a process that takes the aromatic components of hops. So all the parts of the hops that contribute to flavor in beer, Incognito is a concentrated portion of those things. We spent a lot of time comparing Incognito to pellets. We've done multiple studies in-house. So with our panel, if you brew two beers, one with Incognito, one with pellets, and you compare them, we have seen many times that they're indistinguishable. The flavor profile you get from Incognito is just like pellets. We used it just kind of as another tool to boost the complexity of the hop profile. There's T90s, T45s. This was just another tool to use the same hop variety, but have a little bit more complexity. 
We have brewed with the Mosaic Incognito, the Citra Incognito, and the Equinot Incognito. You know, we were very conscious of the fact that, you know, it is a different product, it is an extract, and we really wanted to understand very well whether or not there would be any flavor differences from migrating from a T90 or a T45 pellet into incognito through multiple blind studies through our sensory science department. We found that really there is no appreciable difference between a T90 pellet of say a Citra and a Citra incognito. Some of our customers have seen that incognito has a longer shelf life than pellets. Incognito also adds to shelf life and stability. Once you hop the bejesus out of a beer, you've got sort of a, an end date when that flavor starts to roll off and it's not the true expression of the beer that you were looking for initially. When your IPA is on the shelf with an incognito in it, it's going to store as well or better. When you go into our hop cooler, you'll see there's pallets and pallets of hops stacked up on both sides of the cooler. At the end of the day, that takes up a lot of space. The beauty of a product like Incognito is that you can store it in a very small footprint. It has a lot of bang for the buck and a lot of wallop for the aroma and flavor that it impacts in your finished product. One of the hidden benefits from Incognito is the fact that it replaces cold storage by a ton. You're getting five to six times the alpha concentration, so you're not you know, shipping an entire pallet uh, cross country. Your shipping costs are gonna decrease, and sort of a general rule of thumb that, that we've looked at is that your shipping costs will go down by up to about 75%. The bottom line when you use Incognito is that uh, you're going to increase your yields while at the same time you're not going to sacrifice the aroma and flavor that you're getting from this hot product. I think that Incognito is going to change how people brew going forward. You get consistency, you get product back out of the system that you would have lost. Flavor characteristic and stability are through the roof. There really hasn't been a product like this that is Whirlpool specific, that delivers the characters that we are really confident that brewers will get behind. We thought that there was a really good space for Incognito to not only produce the flavor outcomes that people are looking for in, in these styles, but also help improve process loss. We're using it as an enhancement product to really amp up our hop aroma and flavor. We've had really great results and we're really excited to experiment further and brew different beers. Regardless of the loss savings, regardless of the economics, it's just a fabulous hop product. I would recommend Incognito to a fellow brewer every day of the week. We're super excited about Incognito, so I'd like you to give it a try as well. See whether it works for you in your brewery or brew house. No matter whether you choose incognito made from Citra, Equinot, or Mosaic, you're gonna get consistent flavor, true to variety, every time. We'd like you to give us a call, email us, or visit a website, and we'll show you how easy it is to get started with incognito. And thanks for brewing with Barth Haas. Cheers. Cheers.